going guys we're gonna attempt to take the wall of flesh today uh, let's look go ahead and look at my uh, setup right now so I'm, I'm gonna attempt to kill the wall of flesh mostly just using the mini shark which is crafted actually you don't even craft it you just buy it from uh, that guy down there the arms dealer for 35 gold and it, it does pretty well I'm also using the benefits of the ammo box here which which will uh, give me a 20% chance not to consume ammo. Uh, some people you like using the star cannon. To me, uh, it just takes too long to collect the stars, and it's harder to get that weapon right now. So I'm just going to use the mini shark, the uh, water bolt, which we got in the very first episode from the dungeon. And uh, obsidian skin potion is pretty important, and uh, I'm using a magic power. You might want to use a gravitational potion, which lets you uh, control gravity. You can just move up and down, and then you don't have to worry about the lava. I have a uh, highway to hell here. Let's go ahead and take a straight shot all the way down, as you can see. Got the uh, jungle on my left, the dungeon on my right. I haven't explored a lot of this map, just the top and the bottom and a little bit in the middle there. Um, pretty soon here we're gonna be hitting a lot of water so uh, wall of flesh if you're on the right side of the map he'll spawn f and go from right to left and if you're on the left side he'll go left to right so I uh, if you look down here I've actually built a pretty good uh, highway down here as well but uh, my last attempt I got all the way to the end and he was almost dead and I ran out of highway then it got kind of hard and I had only like 400 health left on him and I died. It was pretty infuriating. So you want to definitely have a pretty long highway if you're going to do this technique. Get some breath of air there. Um, right now I have the full molten armor set. I'm using the cobalt shield and uh, obsidian skull so the fire blocks don't hurt me. Rocket boots, flurry boots, and sandstorm in a bottle. Nothing really too fancy. You could get better stuff. This is by no means the best stuff you can get um, to fight wall of flesh with. It's not the worst either though. I'll, I'll definitely say that. Uh, keep running out of air. The water, I have so much water here, it glitches out and um, it like won't actually go down. It's supposed to be falling into hell, and maybe it is, but it's going so slow that this has been flooded for days. I mean, it, it does empty out into hell, but it's just so slow at doing it. Maybe because we're playing on a server, like a hosted server that we pay for, or by we I mean my friend. <laughs> So, Wall of Flesh has killed me a couple times. Uh, one thing to note also, Wall of Flesh, if you do kill the Wall of Flesh, your game will instantly enter hard mode. You don't like it an option not to, so just be aware of that. And hard mode is something good. You want to be in hard mode because you get better items and stuff, but you also have to fight a lot harder enemies, hence the name. So, just be aware, if you're not ready for hard mode, you might want to hold off on the Wall of Flesh, but... I think hard mode's pretty much the natural progression route, so you, you don't want to like take forever not going into hard mode. Alright, so let's build our, our highway just a tiny bit longer. I have it pretty long already. <laughs> New butt. Let's see what we can do here. All these hearts and uh, mana is from when I fought the wall flesh before. Coming in handy now, healing me. So this is where I stop.
All right, I think we're about ready to start. Let's go ahead and throw the guide into the lava. He does have to be alive for this to work. And, ah, oh, damn it. Let's try that again. All right, and that did spawn the wall of flesh. It's better to try and aim at the eyeballs because they have less defense. They heal you and give you mana too. Focused on the on an eyeball if you can. Because that does the most damage for you. Doing pretty good. I think we're gonna beat him, no problem. management. We are in the home stretch now. The mini shark really helps. And he should be dead. Yes! So many guts. Ancient spirits of light and dark have been released. That's referring to the hollowed and corruption that, um, legendary pone hammer and a laser rifle. The pone hammer is important because you need that to um, destroy certain altars and whatnot. The laser rifle. Ooh, that is pretty sweet. Damn. I like that better than the mini shark. Damn. That's a nice weapon. I mean, it uses mana, but still. You get mana like every time you kill something. And the Pone Hammer is here. Wow, I got the best kind of Pone Hammer too, the legendary version. Look at all that. So, And that will destroy your demon altars, which are previously impossible. Alright guys, well, I uh, hope you enjoyed my Wall of Flesh video. I'm going to get the hell out of here before I die. Heal up. Dropped a bunch of gold too, that was pretty sweet. Living fire blocks. Alright guys, take it easy.